So if you have a line, but it's given to you in the form ax plus by equals c, um, a lot of times you'll want to figure out what are the slope and the y-intercept. So we're going to talk about how to do that today. So let's use an example of 3x minus 2y equals 12. That's the line that we've been given in the form ax plus by equals c. So in order to find the slope and y-intercept, what you want to do is first, um, I mean the easiest way to do this I think is to get it in the form y equals mx plus b. So in order to do that, what you need to do first is you want to get y all by itself on the left hand side. So I'm going to take away 3x from both sides. So on the left hand side we'll just have negative 2y and on the right hand side we'll have 12 minus 3x or to write it better we would have negative 3x plus 12. Now, you might be tempted to say that this is 9x, but remember that these are not like terms. This one has an x in it, and this is just numbers, so you can't combine them. You have to just write them next to each other. Okay, so now I want to get y all by itself. So I'm going to divide by negative 2, because right now y is multiplied by negative 2. So I'm going to divide by negative 2, and I'm going to have to do that to everything in this whole equation. So I'm going to divide everything by negative 2. Over here we just get y, and then over here we have negative 3 over negative 2 is just 3 over 2x plus, and then this is going to be 12 divided by negative 2, so minus 6 is going to be our answer. So now that we have it in the form y equals mx plus b, we know that m is the slope and that's equal to 3 over 2 so m equals 3 over 2 and then b is the y-intercept so this is b um, which is so b is equal to negative 6 so our y-intercept is negative 6 and our slope is 3 over 2.